guys, good morning. Hope you all are doing well today. So today I'm gonna to talk really quickly about what is a toxic relationship? How do you know if you're in one? So a toxic relationship is any relationship where there is any form of abuse or dynamics where you consistently feel hurt, you feel like your self-worth has lowered, and you feel disconnected from yourself and who you are as a person. So this could take many forms. This could look many different ways. This could look like verbal abuse. Because a lot of times when we think about abuse, we think of just physical abuse, but that's not, that's just one small part of this dynamic. It could be constant put downs, criticism, blame. This could also look like gaslighting. And if you don't know what gaslighting is, gaslighting is where someone tries to convince you that your reality is not real, that the things that happened didn't actually happen. So it's kind of a crazy making behavior. So this can also look like control dynamics. There could be a lot of jealousy or passive aggressiveness. And a big one is inability of one or both people in the relationship to take ownership of their behavior, to have accountability. So some other signs of a toxic relationship could be feeling in general like you have a lack of support in the relationship. Just feeling like it's just not there. There's not enough support there. Um, this could also look like communication that is excessively critical or hostile or sarcastic. It could also look like a lot of lying or disrespectful behavior. And what I mean by disrespectful is like if somebody is consistently showing up late to events that you guys have planned or, or, or not showing up and not calling, um, your partner always finding something wrong with you, so someone that's very critical, I said that earlier. Um, if you feel like you're continually hoping and waiting for them to change, that's a big sign that your relationship could be toxic. And if you feel like you're walking on eggshells, that is also a sign that this is not a healthy relationship dynamic. But really, what I tell people, the overall thing that you want to look for to, to, to figure out if your relationship is toxic or not is if your overall experience in a relationship is negative, then that's probably a good indicator that this is a toxic dynamic. You know, in, in all relationships, there's, there's positive moments, of course. You, you wouldn't be there otherwise. But in general, if the overall feeling of the relationship is negative or you're overall feeling hurt, then that is not a good dynamic. So if you think that you could be experiencing a toxic relationship, my number one tip is to get support because then support can help you figure out your next move. Do you need to leave this relationship? Is this something that can be worked on? You know, can both people, if, if the relationship is going to work and, and shift into a healthy dynamic, both people would have to be willing to work on some things, shift some things, take accountability. So yes, please reach out and get support if you think that you are experiencing a toxic relationship because these types of relationships can be extremely detrimental to your mental and emotional well-being. And you guys, if you have a question, if you are in a certain situation and you're not sure, please feel free to reach out to me and I can give you some feedback on that. All right, guys, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.